have a little surprise. Prager. Oh my gosh! Yes. Oh, stop. Isn't that so crazy? Y'all look Thank so you. cute in y'all oh, golfing no. outfits. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm excited. Hi, Hi, how are you? Oh, good. How about you? We had an oh, appointment good. today? Yes, for an ultrasound. Hi, friend. Hey, girl. How you doing? Good. Thank you so much for coming. Of Appreciate course. you, as always. You know, always. I would not miss it. Ugh. I don't mind being your baby daddy. Appreciate you. Yes. <laughs> Remember I told this. you I felt the kick? You felt the kick? Oh, I didn't tell you that yet. I felt Already? the kick. Yeah, two weeks oh, ago. Wow. It, was, it was like, and I was like, and then I thought about it like, oh, that's you what they say. You are starting to feel fluttered. Like, yes. Woo, look at the baby. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, Whoa. It's so oh, big. Look, it's growing. I cannot believe this. Oh, it's looking at you, mama. Look, it's looking oh at you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You should definitely do this when Devin comes here. I know, yeah. I have yeah. so many things to do when Devin comes here. Going through this pregnancy alone can be hard, but I'm happy to have Morgan and some of the other ladies from the basketball world here to support me. It definitely makes some days easier than others. It way back at you to let you know, like, it's we're okay, good. mama. Yeah, yeah, we're good. He'll be here when the time is right. Yeah. Yeah. Can't believe I'm folding baby clothes. I'm five months pregnant, and my husband, Devin, is still overseas playing basketball. Morgan's been really great filling in for him at times. But I do miss my husband, and I really want to experience this pregnancy journey with him. Hi, look Hey. <laughs> What are you doing? Just made myself a drink. Oh, really? Okay. Well, you know, I went to um, get the ultrasound, and it's kind of crazy how big this baby looks. <laughs> first of all, it's the spine. Like, that freaked me out. That's the first thing I saw was this picture. That was the first thing she put on there. Can you can you get more in the, in the actual FaceTime? It's on your chin. Your chin's not in it. There you go. Yeah, put your whole face. There you go. Thank you. So what do you have planned? Just waiting for you to get here and see me and the child. Yeah. I ain't in no rush. Devin is the type of person, you really have to really know him to love him. Like, this child has been growing inside of me for a really long time now, and it's just kind of like, I think that he could give me a little more right now. I haven't even asked Brian nothing. But I hope that he still is trying to get you to possibly sign late somewhere so that you can be here for the birth. I ain't telling him I wanted to do that. I got to first see what's even going on early before I can tell him I'm going to just sign late. Well. I'm disappointed that Devin hasn't talked to his agent yet about signing late to a team. The longer he waits, the riskier it is that he won't get time off to be here for the birth. Things move fast once the season starts, and I don't want to do this alone. Say you gotta focus on yourself and put food on the plate, yeah. After the ultrasound and how our talk went, I'm happy to say Devin is in town. I'm so excited that we're spending time and he's able to really see me in my pregnant element. You should get the hat. That can be a boy or a girl hat. No, for sure. The for first sure. thing you're buying for your baby. Yeah, I do like this hat. <laughs> you know I want a girl, but I don't want to get caught up on it and then it's a boy and I embarrass myself. Yeah, I said I wanted a girl first, though. Right. But then you... So there we are. But you keep talking about one and done, so it's like... So you'd rather have a boy if it's one and done? Why? So you and the boy can do what? So we can do whatever we want to do. What you mean? <laughs> Devin has always said that he wanted three kids. I think that's absurd. The way my body feels right now, I couldn't imagine going through this again voluntarily. So I'm just going to see what happens this first time around, and then we'll go from there. As long as you're able to come home for the birth, that's the only part that freaks me out. Like, you not being here for the birth will really, like, with me. I know. Yeah. I'm really glad that Devin now understands how his absence affected me. Now we can move forward in a healthier way for ourselves and the baby. But also, were you um, gonna give me a push gift? It's supposed to be like right before I give birth, like right before I push. I thought that this was the gift. gift. 
That's funny. As my due date gets closer, I've been preparing for the big day, but I haven't even bought anything because there's one detail I must know, and that's the gender. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm Rachel. I'm Lindsay. Awesome. Nice so I heard you're having a gender reveal. Yes, I am. Great. So let's go um, outside and look at the patio. Okay, awesome. I can't wait to celebrate and find out if I'm having a little baby girl or a little baby boy. So this is our patio area. Um, it is all lit up at night. And there's a great view from the wheel as well when guests are sitting, especially in the back area. And we can do like gift table if they're bringing gifts or anything oh. like that as well. So you don't know nothing? I have no, no, I have Ooh. no idea. Like Devin is just like, he wants a girl, but he feels like a boy would be easier. And everybody says they are. Are they really easy? Who knows? Like you gotta teach a boy how to aim in a toilet. Oh, in. God. That's not easy, I don't think so. No, some people <laughs> still haven't mastered it. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Period. Yeah. Perfect timing. Oh, that looks good. Divine oh. timing. You know me. Oh, oh, is that somebody Parmesan else? cheese? So, how many times did it take you to um, get pregnant? So, basically, I was on depot for like eight, nine years. So I wasn't trying. So you was pretty but fertile. I, I, well, definitely, I feel like what helped is that I started taking like the vitamins and stuff. Like you can start taking prenatals and stuff like that to help. Today is my gender reveal. I'm so anxious and ready to know what is inside of me. Hi, family. All my friends and my family. Oh, you look so cute. This is definitely the happiest moment of my pregnancy thus far. It has been a long time. I had to push this out because Devin was not here. So we're now finally here about to find out the gender of this baby. Everybody got their stickers. Yes. Yes. Hi. Hi, Dad. Oh, you have two stickers on. Dad. <laughs> I'm so happy. Thank you. About to head over to the field so that we can actually see what's inside of me. <laughs> Devin wanted a girl. We're having a girl. This is so exciting. Yeah. 